Hey guys, this is Sai Hari Krishnan from the trendyblog.net and today let's do a quick design and feature comparison of the Vivo Y95 and the Nokia 7.1. Some key features of the Vivo Y95 are hello full view display, a 20 megapixel selfie camera and a 4030 mAh of battery. This is the Vivo Y95 as you can see it looks too cool, it is in purplish color and you have a dual tone color finish you can see if you tilt to the upside you get a purplish color if you tilt to the bottom side you get this bluish color so to the back we have a fingerprint scanner dual camera setup and a vivo branding so friend you can see we have this notch display it's called the hello full view display showing you some of the specification this phone runs on snapdragon 439 although in cpu it's written snapdragon 435 but this smartphone comes with snapdragon 439 chipset it has 4 gb of ram 64 gb of storage comes with android 8.1.0 out of the box has a battery of 4030mAh and have a lot of sensors which will be used for gaming and etc. Checking the Antutu benchmark score of this smartphone, this smartphone scores a score of around 78809. So that's a pretty decent score for a mid range budget segment smartphone. So this smartphone retails at a price of 16990 Given that it's design, it has an amazing uh, full view display, but display is vibrant, the dual tone finish looks amazing. This is an OK 7.1 so this retails at the price of 19,990 and here are some key specifications. This phone comes with HDR screen which is the pure view display technology on the smartphone. We have 12 plus megapixel dual rear cameras with Zs optics, advanced AI depth based imaging, dual side camera and etc. This is the Nokia 7.1 you can see to the back we have the Nokia branding, to the bottom we have Android 1 logo. Then we have a fingerprint scanner, dual camera setup with Zs optics and a LED flash. To the front we have a standard notch. Showing you the GPU-C app, so you can see in the GPU-C app, this smartphone runs on Snapdragon 636 processor and uh, we have uh, the 4 gb of RAM, 64 gb of storage, you can see it's written in OK 7.1. This one comes with Android 9.0, Android 5 which is the latest version with the latest security number patch. Then we have a battery of 3050 mAh, a few sensors etc. So these sensors will be used pretty well for gaming and etc. And to do benchmark on the smartphone. And the score that we got is around 1,17,586. So you can see that's a pretty good score. This phone retails at a price of 19,990. That's pretty good. And uh, it's a Nokia phone. It's built very robustly and gives a premium feeling in your hand. And also with this Snapdragon 636 and a score of 1,17,586, this phone will perform pretty well in day-to-day -day task. That was, was a quick comparison of the Vivo Y95 and the Nokia 7.1. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. For more videos like these, make sure to subscribe to our channel as a trendy blog. Also, check out our website, which is www.trendyblog.net, for more such cool videos and reviews. So, guys, this is Ayurvedic signing off. I'll catch you guys soon. My next one. Till then, peace out.